I was convinced going on that I was going to get Mark Cuban to invest. And he literally, within, it was so quick that he's just like, Jamie, blah, 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 it's great, but I'm out. And I was like, whoo. <laughs> And then I kind of went down the line, and everyone went out, and uh, I went back to my garage broke and uh, broken. So it was, a, it, was a, it was a tough day. I mean, I think this is where people want to hear that, like, you know, I just knew I was going to make it. And I, the drive home sucked. Um, <laughs> because it's not even like when your office is in your garage, like, failure is like a double hit. Because you drive home to, like, get away from the thing, and you have, like, your three puppy dog, you know, employees are sitting in the garage looking at you being like, what happened? And you're like, leave me alone. <laughs> you know, like, 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 so, I mean, it was, we just didn't have it. And, um, you know, the, the, the good news was I was so over my skis. I, I was so over-invested in this thing. I had everything in it that all I could do was keep going. Like, stopping at this point was just literally, it was not, like, stopping was death. Sunday at 10 p.m., I am coming back as a shark. So, thank you. And I know you probably can't spill the beans on whether you invested or not, but what was the experience like being on the other side of that stage? I, I mean, it, it, it truly was like the most, one of the most rewarding things. I mean, to, to be a real person who was in a garage and went on Shark Tank to then ending up being a shark, you, you can't like, I, you could never have set that as a goal. Uh, I mean, it really was just, a, so it's a very surreal thing, very fun. The sharks are actually very nice. And I had a blast doing it. Did you tell them that they made the biggest mistakes of their lives when they let you walk out that door? I'm not that kind of person, so yes, I did. 